end of week Ethereum, merge news fails to hold price up, traders discuss merge related sell off, Binance joins exchanges preparing for possible fork. The price of Ethereum's native token ETH fell over the past 24 hours, while developers identified several bugs and traders started fearing the merge could become a sell the news type of event. On Friday at 9.10 UTC, ETH was down by 2. 8% for the past 24 hours to a price of 1,661 US dollars. The drop was sharper than for Bitcoin, BTC, and enough to make ETH today's second worst performer among the top 10 crypto assets by market capitalization after Solana SOL. This stands in sharp contrast to it being the best performer in that category just the day before. The price drop followed reports from Thursday that Ethereum developers have identified bugs in the software ahead of the merge, or Ethereum's transition from proof-of-work (POW) to proof-of-stake (POS). Details about one such bug were shared by Ethereum developer Petr Shilagi. Writing on Twitter, Shilagi said that the bug, found in Geth January 10, 2022, causes the try slash stay to go bad, adding that he is causes the try slash stay to go bad. A potential sell the news event. While developers discussed the technical risks heading into the merge, traders were, as always, focused on price. Among them was the popular economist and crypto trader Alex Kruger, who warned of risks to market players as the merge nears. Writing on Twitter, Kruger reminded his followers that Bitcoin fell 20% two days before its last halving, and 10% just hours before the halving, calling it a classic case of positioning-driven sell the news. It would make sense for ETH to do the same, Kruger wrote. Binance confirms support for potential hard forks. Meanwhile, crypto exchange, the largest exchange by trading volume, announced on Thursday that it plans to support any tokens that may come as a result of hard forks during Ethereum's switch to proof of stake. Writing in an announcement on its website, Binance said any fork tokens will be credited to users at a 1 to 1 ratio with ETH, while confirming that such tokens can be withdrawn from the platform. It added that a potential listing of a fork token on the exchange will be subject to the same strict listing review process as Binance does for any other coin slash token, and said it the same strict listing review process as Binance does for any other coin slash token.